Hello everybody and welcome back to a server and today I am going to be doing some more skyblock so I've done some work off camera so last episode I started this stone platform here and off camera I finished it I also did some upgrading of the minions which I want to do some work with those today as well I gave this guy right over here, my wheat minion, an extra chest. Uh, let me actually grab up all this stuff. And over here, I actually have a chest full of seeds. You're probably wondering, why do I need a whole bunch of seeds? I'm going to use them to trade for dirt. So the cool thing is if you go to this trading feature here, you can actually trade seeds for dirt. So eight seeds give you two dirt. And then you can exchange four dirt for grass. So, I'm going to buy a whole bunch of this dirt today. So, let's just buy as much as I can now. There we go. So, I bought as much as I could with uh, what I have. So, now what I want to do is I want to get these in my inventory here. And now, I can put these down to make the grass for where I'm going to be putting my house. Now, the cool thing is, I already have grass over here. So, I don't really need to buy the grass blocks. Because all I have to do is just use this grass. But if I buy the grass blocks, if I go back to the trading thing and just do this, it gives me four grass blocks for four dirt. So it's basically just changing the dirt into grass. So if I just like scatter these around, they should hopefully grow the grass in like a whole bunch of different parts. So if I like connect the dirt off of here, I am out of dirt. Oh, wait, no, I have more. So if I just connect these up to the dirt around these sections, the grass should hopefully start spreading to these, like, entire sections over here. And I could actually technically exchange all my dirt in the grass, but I don't really feel like doing that. So I'm just going to buy single blocks of dirt and then just put the grass, like, around in, like, patches like this. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the rest of my seeds that I have from this chest. I'm going to go and turn them all into dirt. Which, actually, I'm not going to need too much dirt. I may have gotten too many seeds. Let me show you how many I've got. So, this chest is full of seeds. I think, yeah, this is the rest of them in here. And maybe some in here. No, I think that's all the seeds. I do want to set up some kind of, like, sorting system eventually for this. I also started to make some enchanted things here. Because... My minions need enchanted, like, resources to upgrade. Like, the stone minion over here. I need, how much? Eight enchanted cobblestone, which I should have enough to do that now. I also want to make some new minions today. I want to make, I think it was the rabbit minion and the wood minion. I want to make those today as well. So that I can hopefully get uh, some more... I think it was the raw rabbit that I needed to get the luck enchantment. So I want to try and get that today. But let's go ahead and make two more enchanted cobblestone, which is eight enchanted cobblestone. Which if I come over here, I can upgrade this guy to which level? Level five, I think. So let's go ahead and upgrade him. And now he's level five. Next tier, we need a whole bunch more enchanted cobblestone. Now, I think that, did that upgrade the inventory? I'm not sure if it did or not, but we have... Some more inventory spots there. I've also got a chest here as well. But I think I might get rid of the cobblestone minion. Uh, because I think I'm maxed. I think you can only have six. And we have four over there, five, and then six. So I, I need to get rid of two of these so I can get the two new minions. Also, these guys are full as well. So I'm going to have to grab some stuff from these guys. I'll just grab a little bit just so they can continue working. I also put a hopper on this guy over here. So he actually sells the gold right over here uh, as soon as, like, he's full. So I'm actually making money from that. I also wanted to buy some armor today. I forgot about that. So first thing I need to do is get rid of all the stuff that's in my inventory. I got to exchange all of these seeds for dirt. So I'm just going to grab some seeds. And I'm going to put some dirt. I also went and got some more diamonds that I can use to make some stuff. I also got a rare diamond. Uh, I don't really know what this does or how I got it. I think I got it from, like, mining all these diamonds. It just happened to give me a rare diamond, which is nice. So, I've got one of those. Uh, also, 
I've learned that this platform over here is a very good mob spawner. I've got in a few ender pearls from endermen that have spawned. So I got to make sure I stay over here so mobs don't spawn in. I also made a, a cleaver, which is pretty powerful. Uh, it also attacks like mobs that are, I think, in like a three block radius next to you. So I'm just going to go through and I'm going to buy a whole bunch of dirt here. And then I'm going to go and extend this platform. Or not extend it, but just cover it in dirt. And then I'll see you when that is done. Okay, so I'm coming up on the last section of dirt. I'm also, I think, almost out of dirt. This is the last bit of dirt that I have. I ran out of seeds. So I'm going to have to look at the wheat minion and see if he's got any extras. But this should be enough to finish this section here. And as you can see, the grass has grown a little bit as well. And there we go. This is a mistake. So we'll go ahead and get rid of that one. I want to also expand this out here. Wait, it rains? Great. I didn't even know that was possible, but apparently it rains here. So let's just go ahead and build this dirt platform out here. I might also... No! No, I do not want to fall off. Who's doing that? Oh, you? I also don't like that it's nighttime. Like, every time I come into this world to, like, do anything, it's always nighttime. Apparently, I got a rare potato, but it fell off. So, we don't we don't get a rare potato. Pretty sure I already have some potatoes anyway. Uh, so, I got to find a better way of connecting this up. But, at the moment... This is, this is the platform. As you can see, stuff is spawning. And it should become daytime here soon. It's apparently like 4.30 in the morning. So, we'll go ahead and get rid of this skeleton. Now what I want to do, now that I've got this platform, is I want to figure out what minions I'm going to get rid of. And I think I'm going to get rid of the melon minion. I think if I pick up the minion, he'll give me the chest. Uh, let's see, where'd the chest go? There it is. So, I have the chest back. All these melons, I think I can get rid of them. And I think they'll actually, like, grow themselves. We don't really have to get the minion to do that. The minion just kind of, like, collects the melons for me. But I think I'm going to get rid of this entire section and turn it into the new rabbit area. So now I need to get rid of another minion. Now, I'm either going to get rid of the stone minion or I have to get rid of one of these guys. And I'm not really sure which one to get rid of. I might get rid of the gold minion. Because I don't know how much gold is going to be helpful for. So, I'm going to get rid of the gold minion here. Let me make sure I collect everything. And you know what? I'm going to give my hopper... Should I give it to the coal minion? I don't know. Which one has more storage? I'm going to give it to the iron. Because I feel like the iron might be worth more than coal. So, I'm going to give that to the iron minion. And then this area right here... I'm going to have to break this away and turn it into the area where I'm going to put the uh, the wood minion. So I'm going to put wood minion here and then rabbit minion. I kind of wanted to put the rabbit minion like up there. So I might do that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the wood minion. So let's go ahead and make these. So what we're going to need for the wood minion is I think a wooden axe and some wood. So let me go ahead and put all this gold in here uh, just so I can store it somewhere. Over here is where all my wood's at. Now, I don't remember if it was logs or if it was wood. I'm just going to get the logs. I also need a, a wooden sword as well, I think, for the rabbit minion. So, basically, to make this minion is you take your wooden axe and you put not logs around it. Let me look at the recipe. Okay, apparently I had it right. I just need more wood. Okay, right, so this is how you make the wood minion. So basically, you put 10 oak logs around an uh, an axe and then you get your oak wood minion so now what I need to do is I need to put them down now I don't know if it needs trees to work oh wait we can get seven minions oh okay I need to be around dirt you are around dirt maybe you need like full dirt here let's get rid of this and replace it with regular dirt he's no longer complaining he has a storage of one so how much do I need to upgrade him Oh, 20 logs around him. Okay. I might actually have that, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. I should give him, uh, like, a skin. Uh, let's see. We'll give him this one for now. So he's got this skin. And then the next thing I want to do is put my gold minion back. So let me get gold minion. Put him back here. 
I forgot which skin did. Did he have the melon skin? Um, no, the melon minion had the melon skin. You know what? You're going to have the melon skin now. That's good. So we've got our wood minion. We got our cobblestone minion. We got our iron minion. And we've got our gold minion. Now I need to get the rabbit minion. Which, uh, let me find where I put my raw rabbit at. Okay, I found it. So I have the, the raw rabbit right here. So I need to make a wooden sword, I think. So if I go and turn this into some wood, I can make some sticks. Actually, I might have a stick. Do I have a stick laying around here? I do. Perfect. So I need one of these sticks, and then I need two wood, and I can make a wooden sword. I'm hoping this is the recipe, if I remember correctly. And then all I have to do is put this around the sword. All right, so apparently I need eight raw rabbit around the sword, and I only have six. So I need to go get some more raw rabbit meat. So let's go ahead and head over here, because I did actually want to head back to the main area anyways. As long as I don't die. You know what? I'm just going through the portal. There we go. Before I die there, I wanted to head back here because I want to get some armor. So one of the things I learned is that over here, I think it's uh, this guy right here. This guy sells you diamond armor. Now, I need to get some more coins. Oh, wait. How did I get 9,000 coins? Um, well... Apparently, I have 9,000 coins. I was going to go back to the bank to uh, grab up some money, but somehow I magically got a whole bunch of money. I don't know where that came from, but let's go and buy all this armor. So we've got the diamond helmet, we've got the diamond chest plate, diamond leggings, and the diamond boots. So there's that. Still have 7,000 coins left, which I don't know where all those coins came from. And now I can wear the brand new armor. So let's go and take off this armor. And let's put on the brand new diamond armor. Uh, so this kind of gives me, it gives me some extra health. It gives me some defense. It's not really the best, but at least I get a little bit more health from it. I think it's still a defense of like 108, which is the same as what I had before. Uh, but what I want to do now is I want to head over to the mushroom forest, I think it's called. Uh, let me look at the map, see what it's actually called. Oh, it's the Mushroom Desert. So that's where I have to go. And I was actually going the wrong way. I'm supposed to go this way. So I'll show you where you get the rabbits from. So let's go ahead and head over here to the Mushroom Desert. And let's find the rabbits. So this is where the rabbits are at. So basically, you just have to keep attacking the rabbits and get as much raw rabbit as you can. And you'll, get, you'll gain the enchantment just by, like, picking it up. Like, that one sadly fell off the side, so we weren't able to get that. But if I just keep going around getting some of these rabbits, I should be able to get enough to make the new minion. And then I don't have to come over here and farm the rabbits anymore. So I should have enough uh, raw rabbit now to make my brand new rabbit minion. Now I'm going to go ahead and use my personal crafting table that I have here. We're going to go ahead and put the raw rabbit around the wooden sword. And there we go. Raw rabbit minion one. So let's go ahead and head back. We're going to use the teleport thing here. Head back to the main island. And once again, it's nighttime. It's always nighttime. I don't know what it is. It's like never daytime when I'm here. Uh, so what I want to do with this guy is I need to put him in a specific spot. There should be like two blocks on either side. So if it goes two blocks here and then two blocks there. So the minion should be right here. So now does he work or is he going to complain that I need something more? He might need something more. Now, I did say on the wiki to put a fence around him, but I'm not sure if I really need a fence because he's kind of just spawned in the rabbit. I don't know. How much do I need to upgrade? So it's 16 raw chicken around the minion to upgrade him. So I don't know if I'm going to need a fence or not. If I'm, Let me make a fence real quick. I should have enough wood to make a quick fence. So one, two, three, four, five. And then I think we need another fence here. Let me go and pick this guy up. And then you go one, two, three, four, five. And then one, two, three, four, five. And then like this. Did I do this right? There should be two blocks on either side. So two blocks. He needs to go here 
So that's where he's going to go. And then there needs to be two blocks here, two blocks there. We need two blocks in front. So this fence needs to go here, and then it needs to go out here. So now this should be in the right spot. So this is going to be a rabbit pen for a rabbit minion. I might make a fence gate. I don't know if that's going to help. So if I do a fence gate right here, I need to make... Uh, some more wood so I can do that. Perfect. No! Get in there. Oh, great. Uh, we got a runaway rabbit. Get get, get the rabbit. There we go. Okay, we got one of the rabbits. So now this should be working. This should be set up now, which is nice. See, I can't reach him. I have to actually go in here and reach him. So I want to give him a skin. Uh, let's go look at what we have for skin options. Oh, wait. We have the Grinch minion skin. Wait, what other ones do we have in here? There's a Santa minion, a present minion. I didn't even know these existed. There's a reindeer minion skin. There's anything else? A bunny minion skin. Yes. We're going we're gonna to give him the bunny minion skin. There we go. I didn't even know I had these extra ones. Wait a minute. Isn't this? No, it's not. It's not his face already. It's a, it's a different one. So if I put this on here... There we go. Now he's got a carrot. Perfect. So we've got the bunny minion skin. And then I want to change maybe one of these so that we have a different skin. So where are the other ones? They're in here. So what other skins do we have? There's a bee minion. Ooh. I kind of want to put this one for the... For this guy over here. Instead of like the sun, I'm going to change this one to a bee. So let's change that. There we go. Now we got a bee minion. Try to think of a good one. I might do present. You know, we'll do a present for the tree minion. So we'll come over here to the tree minion. I'm uh, going to take this off and give him the present minion. There we go. We got the present minion. So that should be all the minions set up now. And I think I've maxed them out now. So I should have seven minions, uh, which is going to be helpful. We've got a stone minion over there. Actually, can I get this Enderman to come over here? Come over here, Enderman. I want to get another Ender Pearl. So next episode, I'm going to work on doing the house. I'm going to put it like right over here in this section. I might also move the farming minion over here as well in this uh, grassy bit. That way I can kind of get rid of this wheat area here. And I might make a, a better spot for these guys. I might move this guy somewhere else and move the cobblestone minion there. So this is just like the, the mining area. And then we'll put like maybe the tree over there. Which uh, might be a pretty good idea. So I'm going to work on that next time. Oh yeah, I also got this cool new armor. So now I have enchanted diamond armor, which is nice. Which all it does is it gives me like bonus health. It gives like the same defense that I had before. But at least I have, I think it's 25 extra health with like the full set on, which is nice. So I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. So make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time. Goodbye, everybody.